What's up guys and welcome back. We're back in Middle Earth with more Rise of Mordor, but what do we have here? We have a sub mod for the Rise of Mordor and we are playing as Dol Amroth, the home of the Swan Knights. So they look amazing. So if you don't know where Dol Amroth is, it is a it's part of Gondor almost. It's like a principality, it's like a tributary of Gondor. So they have very similar sort of armor as you can see here. They have like the I'm trying, to, I'm trying to look at you, man, and you, you're not helping. So they still have, like, the white tree on some of them, but they also look, and as you can see in the background, they have, like, the, the swan on their breastplate. So they have, an in, like, interchanging, and then they have, um, like, the, the white ship, Dol Amroth. They have, like, all sorts of the swan again. So, um, yeah, these guys look amazing, and there are so many more factions that um, are in this submod, and they've done an amazing job. I would love to... To just say to the modders that they've done an amazing job at just recreating these awesome units. So I'll we'll quickly go through some of the units um, before we start the battle. We have the Knights of the Silver Swan here, who I've just shown off to. They look amazing. Look at this guy's sword. Look at this guy's sword. Look at the hill and the swan on it. That is amazing. It is an in, that is an insane sword, man. And then we have back here, we have the General Unit. And um, I'd just like to look at that... Um, at the like the stats it says trained and there's like there's other ones that say elite and there's some that's levy so it shows like instead of having tier one tier two tier three it shows like how elite they are in a in a slightly different way and i like that i like that they've done it i don't know if that's just for this mod or if they've changed that for attila i'm um, i think it's just for this mod um but yeah these talon knights look amazing um they're just well they're very similar to the swan knights but they've got like a they've got like a cool a cool sort of mask like chain mask going over there. That looks really cool. I like that. And there's swan hel swan feathers on the back of the helmet. It just looks amazing. So I'll quickly go over to some of these uh, infantry. These infantry look amazing. We have like the Tarnostian spearmen. Not quite sure where they're supposed to be. I guess Tarnos is like a part of Dol Amroth, I presume. We have Tarnostian marksmen who look very similar. They like they've got slightly different um, sort of markings on their on their uniform, they look really cool though. They're like, they haven't got really other sort of the swan, they've just got like swirls. And then we've got um, Sea Ward Sword Infantry. These guys look, well, I'll try and get a better view of them. They look just like Gondor's uh, m troops, really. Very similar in sort of look and style. As I said, they're like a principality part of Gondor almost. And the Prince of Dol Amroth is kind of like in the books of uh, Lord of the Rings, I'm pretty sure it's kind of a major character. Well, not a mage character, but he, he gets mentioned. So we've got these guys. These are like sort of the uh, Gondor infantry sort of guys. Then I think, well, we'll have a look at these guys quickly. The Haven Guard. They're, they're, they're marked as an axe unit, which is quite funny. But they are actually a double-sworded unit. But look at these guys. They look amazing. This is like a really elite unit. They hold their sword really funny. And they're like, aren't you going to cut yourself doing that, man? You're not even looking. This guy's just going through the pain. He's like, I do not care how many times I'm cut with my own sword. I will kill every orc in sight. But yes, he is very fearsome. And they look amazing, those guys. I think they're, they're my like most elite unit. There's only 90 of them in a unit. Then we have um, Nim, Nim Riddell Rangers. These are like the Athelian Rangers. But for, uh, for, the, for Dol Amroth, these look, guys look amazing as well. They look very, very cool. They're going to hide away in bushes and just shoot lone orcs out and do some damage. Then we've got these guys. I'm trying to remember what these guys' name are called. Dismounted Talon Knights, of course. So these guys are even more elite. And they're just like the cavalry guys, but they're on foot. They've got the same uniform, and they look amazing. So we'll quickly have a look at uh, Mordor as well. They've got a few new units. Um, I'll start the battle and let Mordor come towards me um, while they're doing that. They have... Orc mercenaries, are they going to, like, they move, they move so quickly, does Mordor I found in this submod, I think, anyway. It's just me. But, uh, these Orc mercenaries look very, very cool. They look slightly different. They've got, like, some bear skins. And then, we now have, uh, Vassal Southron Cavalry, which is really cool. I'm just checking that I actually have my, uh, archers on, uh, skirmish mode, because they have, their Southron Cavalry are moving very quickly. Um... Try and see what other units we have now. Uruk Throng, we've seen them before. Uruk Archers. Orc Rabble. Ah, yes. When you have expendable orcs that you need to just throw at the enemy. 
This is all gravel. These are like your levy units I was telling you about. So we've got some... Uh, I'll go through these possibly a bit more in detail and at a later date. But I'm just trying to quickly show you off. We've got uh, Mountain Orc Spear Fodder. These guys look pretty damn cool. They're like... Doing, they've got all the sword weapons. And then um, I think there's a sorted unit for them as well. But we'll come back to them because we're about to have a cavalry charge here. Which I'm not going to be able to get to in time. That's excellent. But yeah, they're charging in, doing some damage. Um, I better actually fight the battle. Unfortunately, uh, no replays to be able to use in this one. I've tried it several times and it uh, crashes. Unlike the normal Rise of Mordor mod, where it's fine, this just uh, crashes quite often. Unfortunately, guys, I'm sorry. Not much I can do about it. If there is a way that you know to uh, sort out that problem, then uh, please let me know because I would love to uh, just be able to commentate and not have to dictate the battle as well. Um, archers, can you start firing at some guys? Okay, these guys are just going to charge in here. But we'll quickly have a look at these Southron Cavalry while they're here. Oh, that's a nasty volley there. That's probably got some friendly fire. Hopefully most of these uh, Swan Knights... Uh, these not, I want to call them Swan Knights, but they're not Talon Knights. Get up. Yeah, they, they look pretty damn good. They look like the uh, the normal Southron uh, troops, but just on f on horse with a few spears. Oh, oh um, we're getting shot now by the Uruk archers. Jeez, these cavalry are really dangerous. Can you uh, attack them, please? Pull back. I'm going to move my cavalry around so we're actually doing some damage. Um, and I'm going to move these spears round as well. I'm going to put them to like here. Make it like an angle. Force Mordor in. Almost. Um, these cavalry are almost broken. But there they go. They're broken. Excellent. Um, I'm going to make a, a movement there. That sort of angle. Okay, you don't need to go that far back, pal. Just go and shoot these guys. Um, I thought I had more archers, but maybe not. Where are all my archers? Uh, we've got one there. One here. Uh, why is one back here? You cowards! Get back to the battle! So all the uh, infantry are on really like... All the orc infantry anyway are on really high uh, difficulty. Basically so they uh, they just get a move on and do some stuff. We're going to have to get in and uh, attack I think because their archers are picking off my troops. Can you um, focus down their archers? You focus down their archers, and you focus down their archers. Um, my, okay, we've got more stuff here, and you're going to be needed over here. I can already sense it. All right, there's going to be a clash of infantry here. Oh, that's that's pretty nasty. They've got the better charge they did there. Let's watch this charge. This is going to be a good charge. These just, the models look so good. There we go. In the breach. Into the breach. Ugh. It's not really a breach. But look at those, um, the orcs as well. I know we showed them off in the last uh, battle that we did. But they look so good to those orcs. They look scary. Rip in peace. That guy must have died. So anyway, um, we'll quickly, let's finish the battle while we're, while we're here. Um, Talon Knights, you might as well go in. Um, send my guys uh, on horse around. Or oh, my cavalry, I should call guys on horse. What am I? I'm not a scrub. I know the names of these units. Um, just about. Right, so the Talon Knights have gone in and they're sort of, well, they're well out of the way. They're probably going to die, actually. Uh, General, you might as well come in and kill some people. Excellent. Right, you go in there, and you also go in there. These cavalry are going to do some damage. Come on, boys. There's my general in the red. This is the Prince of oh, Amroth. He's coming in for the kill. Hurry up, guys. Get him. Get him. Run them down. Yes, kill these Uruks. No one cares about them. Uruks have no lives. All right. They are trying to take out our general. 
Well, they can try, but he's a blooming strong boy. We've encircled a lot of orcs here. Gonna, let's have a go look at their situation. Oh, I don't know why it's lagging. This is new. This looks insane. It just looks amazing. See, so yeah, there's plenty more um, units. Uh, well, not units. Uh, factions now in this mod. We now have goblins. There's now a goblin faction, so I could do the Mines of Moria. Erebor, I think, has even got um, almost... I think it's got more units in it. I could be wrong there. Enemies rallied their units, have they? Well, let's just kill this general and then we can uh, worry about their u rallied units. Because they're not going to be strong. Um, let's pull you out there. Thank you. We'll not have uh, swords chasing down my general, thank you. Go and charge over there. You keep going over there, please. Oh, God, run. Kill them, please. Okay, we're doing okay in the center here. Uh, my archers could do with maybe focusing down some archers. Oh, we've slaughtered them here. And um, kill these guys in the rear. Not quite sure. Uh, I played this battle a little, a little while ago, and it wasn't as uh, just to like try out the mod, and it was uh, not as easy. Last time the Orcs put up a stern fight, but we're crushing them this time. Absolutely crushing them. Oh, they look so beautiful. Just kill all the Orcs. Orcs, orcs have no lives. Their, ma their lives don't matter anyway. Um, go over there, please. Uh, just kill all these people. General, go over here. Kill the archers. Kill them. Um, you're getting stuck on people. Oh, that's a good charge. Kill all of them. Send them back to the Black Gate. But I mean, yeah, I'm really happy that I found this sub mod. I'm not sure how long it's been out because I'm not sure how late I am to the party in uh, showing this sub mod off. But I'm so glad I found it. Just gets my Lord of the Rings juices flowing just even more. They're really, really. Um, which I mean, they don't need, need encouraging. I just love this world. And this and the universe is just amazing, but I mean yes, the uh, modders have done an excellent, uh, excellent work on this base already. I've said it so many times, but I just can't get over like we have Swan Knights that look amazing, and I hope they add um, similar units to the uh, normal mod so I can do replays and just focus on that because I just I just like to uh, be able to sit back and relax instead of having to stress about whether my archers are doing anything or. But look at this, look at the mass of silver armor that there is here and all the swans on their helmets. It's amazing. So it's quickly yeah, I think we've got got everyone. This is that, that's it. That's that's GG. So uh, that was quicker than I expected, guys. So I've heard, I hope you've enjoyed that. It's a little snippet of uh, what's to come on this submod. Hopefully they add a lot more. And uh, I'll keep you up to date on it. And now let's end the battle. And we'll have a we'll have a look at the stats quickly. So I deployed a lot less than the uh, the AI. Hopefully, if anyone's got this mod as this sub mod as well, or the Rise mod or mod, and wants to um, get the sub mod, it's on Steam. It's very easy to find. Um, and they want to play me, I'm more than happy to because it would be more fun than playing the AI because it's more of a challenge, more of a challenge, more joy. But anyway, yes, we lost 400 compared to their 2,400. The the uh, Swan Knights and uh, the Talon Knights are just far too good. I'm calling them the Swan Knights because that's what they really are. Um, but yeah, all these infantry here, dismounted Talon Knights, the Seaward Sword Infantry, doing very, very well. All getting mostly 100 plus. Um, the Ta Haven Guard doing, getting 200 each nearly. And the Spears, Spears doing remarkably well for Spears. They're extremely good. The uh, Nimrodel, the Rangers not doing so well. And they were the better archers, that's a bit of a shame. But these Tanostian Marksmen doing very well. And the cavalry, obviously, just stealing the day with some of their kills. Very, very good. Their um, cavalry not doing so well. Archers doing okay, but not great. Um, they're, some of their pillagers did very well. 104 kills. Those axe units are uh, not to be underestimated. But apart from that, they weren't so great. Because it's, well, it's just a, a normal orc army, really. It's been slammed together. 
The orc rabble getting a few kills. Shame on you if you died to an orc rabble. They're just a they're just an orc with a sword in hand. They've not got any training. But anyway, guys, if you've enjoyed that video um, and the battle, then leave a like and subscribe if you're new around here. And until next time, bye for now.